ladies and gentlemen, and all the rest of your protectors out there, hello and welcome back to Starbound with Frackin' I'm Hurt. With Frackin' Universe. Uh, I've been doing some background playing here. Um, yeah. I went ahead and placed me one of these things down and left and came back after doing some upgrades. And one of the things that I did, we'll look inside here, is I'm wearing the Researcher's Greaves breastplate and helmet, which gives me a immunity to oxygen, poison, gas, and acid. That's handy. Also has uh, radiation resistance, which I'm already wearing a radiation resistance, but I can swap this out now because of that, I think. Probably shouldn't, though, because that gives me a 40% reduction, which is quite nice. But, for the time being, I've got good armor. Got okay armor. Anyway. But uh, we're back here on the insectoid planet. Well, not planet, but their colony that I found. And we're going to spend some time doing some missions for these guys. And uh, if we're lucky... Who are you? Why are you following me? Okay. Uh, if we're lucky, we may find us an avian colony slash settlement, whatever, that we can do some research on and find their boss, their whatever you call it. But these guys have so many missions for us that we're going to go out and do them. And see if we can get us an insectoid crew member. If they'll even become crew members. I'm not even sure if they will or not. But I mean, they, hey, good lord, they are just full of missions. Uh, I'm going back to this person. Do we even have timber on me? I think I have timber. Yeah, timber. That's with log. I can make timbers. Yeah, I got timber. Okay. Anyway. So that's what we're doing today. How y'all doing? Hope y'all doing well. I uh, hope y'all been enjoying the uh, Space Engineers build-offs, which by the time this releases, at least two of them should be out. Maybe? One of them, for certain, is already out. And, uh, it's been nice getting back into the building aspect of Space Engineers. Uh, how far am I going? Crap. This guy's way too far for me to be going. You're following me now, too. Why are you following me? Okay, you got stuff... Oh, you have graphene. I need graphene. I need all the graphene. Mercenary's helmet. Uh, Stow? Shoat. Farm beast egg. He's a shoat. That looks nice. A little short, though. What can I sell you? Uh, something strange happened while I was doing upgrades and stuff. Um, got nothing. Ah, I brought some of my stuff with me. Crap. Um, can I sell poison? You don't. Nah, I can buy poison back. Um, I upgraded my needler. And it decided to poof on me. It just went poof. Disappeared. And, yeah, that kind of sucks. I was looking forward to upgrading the damn thing and using it, and it poofed. I had something else poof on me, and I don't quite remember what it was. Oh, it was my uh, rocket launcher. That rocket launcher I found way back was upgradable. And it poofed on me after upgrading it. Now I don't know what happened. I don't know if that was a glitch, or if something happened weird on my end, or... I don't know. Kinda sucked. I liked that rocket launcher, but at least we still got this. This is a pretty damn good weapon. And, uh, anyway. Also upgraded this as far as I could get it. But, uh, yeah, I wasn't feeling recording Starbound for a little while there, so I kinda stepped away and just kinda played in the background a little bit. A lot of menial, boring not recordable stuff. Can y'all kill that thing, please? Thank you. So anyway, took care of all that. And here we are. 
Alright, this guy's taking way too far to get back to. I am not going back to him. We're just going to drop off that whole mission and go back to where we were. <laughs> and I'm not doing that one. That's, that's, that's too far. That's too much. I'm not doing that. Again, I'll go back to the fact that these fracking universe planets are so damn big that it starts to suck out enjoyment. And, uh, yeah. I'm not gonna, I'm, I'm not gonna go through all that. Avian <gasps> Ooh, there's an avian tomb here. That means I can... Oh! We got two birds with one stone here. Pun very much intended. Come on, guys. Can y'all just stop attacking random things? That'd be nice. That the chip. Teleport a core. What is that? That is a rocket launcher. Hey! I think the game felt sorry for me for losing my rocket launcher. It just gave me another one. Nice. Let's have to play with that a little bit later and see how that works. Oh, hey, it's our buddies. Mm -hmm. Hey, guys. Oh, God. You know. Considering how long I just walked in one direction. Back to where my stuff is. Alright, did I get everything? Got everything. Alright. So let's see if we can try not to die this time. Let's see if we can manage that. Okay, this is not the avian place, but there are some eyeball critters over there. This is a uh, glitch. A glitch fortress. But this is not where I need to be, so I'm going to just pass through for now. No doubt I'll need to come back here. Something I could probably do to start helping me out is carrying flags around. And when I find places like this, just place down a uh, flag at their entrance. How did you not die from that? Tough little Rubega. A group play in Fracking Universe would probably render some of my issues uh, dealt with. I think you can always just teleport back to one of your teammates. And that would make these enormous planets feel uh, a little less enormous, I guess. Unfortunately, most people that I had the potential of playing Fracking Your uh, Starbound with, they don't want to go through the trouble of modding their game or changing out the uh, files on their computer mm -hmm. to have a modded game. And, and I can understand that. So, 
yeah, another reason why I might end up going to a vanilla game at some point. Still haven't gone far enough east to find this damn avian temple yet. What does that blow me? That's a sewer. Okay, we have a, uh, what was your series is called again? I forgot. A Halata. You just randomly out, okay. I mean, you got a nice view and all. It's kind of dangerous out here, you just, just set up shop, okay. It looks like the arrow's moving a bit, so I must be getting close. Before I get too much further, do I have what it takes to build? No, I don't. I need woven fabric. Crap. <sighs> woven fabric comes from cotton. Yeah, I think I just need to start carrying those with me. But, um. Uh... Yeah, I guess, I guess what I'm getting at is don't be too surprised if I end up starting over with a different set of mods, if any mods at all. Hey, we found it. Alright, here we go. There's him. Let's look at this for a moment. Hey, buddy. Alright, so you're coming along for the adventure. Let's go down here and see what we can find. Ouch. Did somebody want an uh, sarcophagus? I think somebody wanted a sarcophagus.
definitely getting some lag. Let's see something here I can click on. I don't want to find a standard settlement. Get the rest of the stuff. Did someone kill that thing, please? Thank you. like we just about got all the clues. Again, I may end up having to go to a different temple or even a um, a uh, like a settlement. That's a healing too. That's pretty nice. That's just death. All right, let's get out of here. We came who we we got. We have who we came for. Oh, there's a guy up here. I didn't see you, buddy. So deep. So leave me the hell alone. Now with improved jump. Uh, this should be something I can scan.
Alright. Now we can get out of here. I don't know how to get out of here. Might need to dig my way out. Did I already go this way? I haven't. One or two more things that I can click on to find. And that was one of them. What a chance if I can click on one of those. Again, I might be able to find something here. Maybe. Let's go up top here. Nope. That don't count for nothing. Nope. Nope. Okay, I guess that's going to be it until we find another place of avian stuff. friends back over here. There's one of them. Oh, the glitch temples first. So we'll come back to the glitch temple after the avian tomb. Probably better. about you? Avian tomb. A lot of you insect folks tend to get lost in that avian tomb. Stop going there! Woodbridge Glitch Fortress. Probably should unload before I actually take off. Since I haven't traveled that far yet. I'm gonna do that. Drop off some goods. Just want to do boxes here. There. Now if I die and say screw it all, I don't have to worry about going back. Now what do I get out of dirt? Science or research, whatever. All right. All right. Onwards to the Avian Temple and the Glitch Fortress again. 
Uh, what do you got? Certainly. Why not? I'll have an enormous crew when I get back. Uh, people following me. Damn it. I just realized I got picked up some of my damn woven cloth and made some of those, uh... You know what? I ain't worried about it. I'm just gonna complete these missions and we're gonna try to find some more avians. <sighs> Speaking of, I did. Didn't I get stuff? Yeah, let's see what's in here. I'm gonna put my journal. Iron ore? I ain't worried about you. I'm give you all my iron ore anyway. You can go get it yourself. You're, you're a surviving, thriving colony. Go get your own damn iron. But yeah, if I decide to keep fracking universe, I think that's what I'll do. I will, uh, make a... Oh, hello. 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 Go, go away. Anyway, I will uh, make a bunch of those flags. And basically just keep them with me. Try to make one, uh, one full revolution around the planet as I discover things and place down flags at points of interest. I guess that's a strategy I could use. Handed short barrel shotgun. Uh oh. Okay, I about to say I thought I ran out of room. That'd be kind of nice. If I walk away with at least one crew member, I would be happy. I don't think that's gonna happen though. Yeah, I'm not going back to glitch fortress for you, buddy. Okay. What are these javelins? Let's go home. I wonder if I could go back to the avian settlement and do a mission or talk to a few of those people and get that last bit of uh, information that I need. Alright, let's uh, let's grab some stuff out of the ship and head on over to the outpost and sell some junk. And then we'll see if we can get that last little bit of information from the avian settlement.